maths and it's me Priska Joseph. In the last class we have discussed the core concept of the chapter real numbers and now it's a time to solve some problems from the chapter that is our exercise problems. Before moving to our class if you are watching my channel please subscribe it and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Your comments are precious for me so please comment below. So let's here First one is express each number as a product of prime factors. We discussed it in the first class. So here the first question is 140. So we have to factorize this number that is 140. Let's start it with the 2. So 2, 2 7s are 40, 70, again 2. It will become 35. And again, 5, 7. Okay. So, how can we write this uh, factors? That is, 2 into 2 into 5 into 7. Or, 2 square into 5 into 7. So, 140 can be written as 2 square into 5 into 7. So, this is the answer. So, next one, 156. Next, next is 156. That is, one, 156. Let's start here with the 2. So, 78. And here, it is 39 and again 3. So 1, 3 is 3. 3, 3 is 9 and finally this. So 156 can be written as 2 into 2 into 3 into 30. That is 2 square into 3 into 30. So, 156 can be written as 2 square into 3 into 30. So, these are the prime factors of 156. Next is 3825. Since the ones place of this number is 5, let's start it with 5. So, 7, 5 is 35. 6, 5, 765. Again, 5. 1, 5 and 3. Again, 3. 5, 3s are 15, 51. And uh, again, 3. 1, 3 is 3, 21, 70. It is. So these are the factors of 3825. That is 5 into 5 into 3 into 3 into 70 or 5 square into 3 square into 70. So, these are the prime factors of the number 3825. Okay. And there are two more questions. That is. And the second last one is 5005. Since the one's place is 5, let's start with 5. Okay. So, 5005 completely divisible in 5. That is 1001. Next is um, by 7. I mean, 1 7 is 7. 4. 4 7 are 28. 3 7 are 21. And in 11. Uh, 1 11 is 11, 33, 3. Okay. One. So, factors of 5, factors of 5005 is 5, 7, 11, 13. That is 5 into 7 into 11 into 13. So, the, these are the factors of 5005. And the last one is 7429. Actually, this is a difficult one. No matter, let's do it. So, uh, 
7,429. Uh, 19 can be, sorry, 17 can be completely divisible in this number. So, 17, uh, 7, 4, 60, 68, and 62, 3 times, that is 51. One, 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 nine. Okay. So, one hundred and ninety. So, in seventeen, we get four hundred and thirty-seven. Okay. Next, uh, this four hundred four hundred and thirty-seven can be completely divisible in ninety. Okay. So, what is the answer? This. 19 to 38, 57, 23. Okay, here it is 23. And we know that this 17 and 19 and 23 all gives are prime factors. So factors of 7429 is 17 into 19 into 23. So this is the answer. Hope you understand this question clearly. Hope you understand this question clearly and practice it well. Okay.